Good morning everyone, this is a circuit class this morning. So we're going to be doing four exercises for 60 seconds each exercise and then we're going to repeat them three times through after a little breather in between each set of work. So the exercises are back to back so it is going to be nice and challenging. If you wish to work easier, do it body weight, modify the exercise as much as you need to or simply do less time. So maybe it's just do it for 30 seconds and have a little rest in the middle. It is entirely up to you. So if you've got a little bit of room, brilliant, just to set up some of your equipment so you can just go back to back between each exercises, but you don't need tons of room. It is entirely up to you how you want to work it. Quick warm up and then we're going to get into the first circuits. So let's put a little bit of background music on. So we're going to start with a nice deep squat, take the feet nice and wide and sit the bum right down. So we want to stop the hips just above the knees. The deeper we go, the quicker you're going to warm up. One squat, one lunge, one squat and rise. Down, back, down and up. It's a great way to warm into the legs and we've got a tough workout ahead so we want to work and warm quick. One more, holding with the squat position, you're going to reach to the outside of the knee and take it to a wood chop. Core is braced, body weight through the heels, and let's switch sides. So nice big twist from the waist, trying to face the hips forwards. One more, and let's come down to the ground. Press ups, hands wide knees or toes, push the chest through and drop the chest to elbow height. Two more, then bring the hands in slightly, let's bring it into a plank and into some mountain climbers, drive the knees towards the chest and you can move a little faster or you can work slow. Jump it up, Make it a skater. Step to the side and touch down. Add in a little jump if you can. Well done. Running on the spot if you've got a bench like me, just up and down. Change legs. more. Well done. Five burpees from everyone. Down, back, in, up. You can add the jump on the end if you wish. Down, back, in and up. Once you've done five, warm up is done. One more. Well done. Little shake off, and let's get the four exercises set up. So all you need, for your first move, is a medium to heavy plate. You then have two moves needed, two plates needed, a bench and some room, okay? So your first move, overhead squat, plate overhead, option, plate here. Your next move, alternating backward lunge, alternating front to side, raises. So alternate the legs, alternate through the, feet, the arms. Box step ups, or box jumps, or if you're not doing it, using a bench, you can just do a ladder run of forwards and back squat jumps. Rotating plank, so option is obviously from your knees, from your toes, and option if you can is to rotate. So feet need to stay nice and wide, come right onto the side. Okay? So you've got 
60 seconds to work at your own pace. Grab your plate for round one. Overhead squat with the plate. Go. Feet wide. Lock the core in. And let's just keep the plate forward to the face. Knees and toes are going to go out in line with your big toe. And if you wish to work easy, hold the plate here. But make sure that your core is still braced. So work at a good pace. Bear in mind you've got four minutes to work hard. Twenty more seconds. Try and push to the outside of the feet. Try and stop the hips just above the knees. Five more seconds, guys. Watch the next move. Two light plates, alternating lunge, alternating raise, go. So you need to have a quick switch. If you struggle, one at a time, or just focus on one part of the move. So you may find it's arms, you may find it's legs, your choice. 30 seconds left. Twenty seconds. Front thigh, parallel to ground. It should burn. Now you guys keep moving. Watch your next move. Option one, go. Option two, box jumps. Bend your knees either way. Take the knees and toes, corners of the room, when we hit the box jump. And make sure that your heels fully land on the bench top. If you are running, full foot on the bench, Try and go as fast as you can, and then change legs now. Deep as you can. Use the arms to lift the chest. Keep working. Remember variation of your next move. Here, here or rotating. Go. Slow this one down. Feet wide. Move on to the side of your feet. Now if you struggle, you can just hold from your knees or you can rotate from your knees. Your choice of work. Either way, pull the core in tight. Find control, bring the eye gaze to the hands. Breathe. Protect your lower back. So if you find the pressures on the lower back, hold the variation of a plank. 10 more seconds. Breather is coming. Let's hold on. rest. 30 seconds rest. We're going to do it all again. So round two, you know the moves. Let's think about the range of movement to increase your intensity. Grab your plate. Overhead squat. Ready? Go. So round two, you're going to be nice and warm. So try and increase the range if you can. 
Pull your core in tighter. Doesn't matter how fast you go. Focus on the depth of the squat and where your plate sits in the air. Ease your option. Don't give in. Make it easier. Halfway. Now breathe. 20 seconds left. Sweat so should be dripping down your arms. Legs and arms should be burning. Five seconds. Backward step and lunge. Front and side raises. Go. Now stay low in the lunge. So come back to a half squat. Arms to shoulder height here. Elbows to shoulder height here. Long step back to 90 degree angles through the legs. Brace the core. Come on. Don't give in. Breathe and push through the bed. 10 more seconds. Box jumps are coming. Ready? Go. Stand at the landing. If you can. You can always run up and down your box. Or remember your options. If you don't have a box jump, wide to narrow run, or forward squat jump, backward squat jump. 30 seconds. Push the elbows through, lift the chest. Rotating plank on the buzzer. Here. 
to get more reps in, you can always join back in. Ah, uh, 10 seconds. Lunge raises. Heavy weight or not? Your choice. Come on. Try and come back to your feet shoulder width apart. It's going to help with your balance. Shoulders, back, legs and core working here. If you struggle, backward step in lunges, take out the step, do a few, and then change over. Twenty left. Yes, you can. These final few reps are the most important. Box jumps coming. Or step ups. Or whatever you can. How we doing? You doing good? Stay with it. Remember, your choice of work, your pace. One coming.
go. Inside leg straight, drive the knee up to hip height. Working your inner and outer thigh and your glutes. So really start to push away from the floor. Push and lift. That foot glued to the ground. Change sides. Big step, big drive. You might find it's easier or you've got more range on one side. It's fine. Work with what you've got. Feel that inside leg stretch. Half burpee, box jump coming. Feet wider than normal. One half burpee, up and down. One half burpee, up and down. Your choice is you can walk the legs back, walk them in, walk up and down. You can run it, with my head, you can run it. If you've not got a bench, just do it on the floor. It's fine. Halfway. So we're staying in a squat to keep the pressure in the legs. Keep moving, 15 more seconds. While you're working, watch your next move. Two low squat jumps. Two plate snatches. Go. Two low, two snatches. Jump forward, jump or step back. Stop the weight. Forward to the face. You can use one weight down the middle. If you choose 30 seconds left, you can take out the jump if you wish. 20 left. Stomp your feet into the ground. Keep going. Full sit-ups coming in. Five. Weight to chest. Leave the weight on the chest. Hard eruption. Keep it up. Forward of your face. Roll through the spine, push the heels into the ground. Ease your option. Lose the weight, bring the hands to the back of the thighs, use them to help you up. So you've really got to think about rolling through the spine, pushing the heels into the ground in order to sit up. 20 seconds, give it everything that you've got. Don't let it feel lift if you can help it. Rest. 30 seconds. Grab a drink. Stretch off. Do whatever you need to do. Reset. Next round of work. Side lunge, knee lift. Now you know the moves. Three, two, one. 30 seconds each side. Use the elbows, push them through to keep the chest lifted. Takes pressure away from your back. Remember round two, always handle than round one. Your body is fatigued, so don't worry if you need a little breather. 
switch sides. Step as far as you can to the side. Keep that foot pushed into the ground, push to the outside of the foot. So when you come here, push the floor away. Have burpee box jumps. Keep moving, 10 seconds. Just watch. Wait for the timer, go. Stay low, jump back and up. Press the core, heels onto the bench. Keep the pressure in the legs by staying low. Remember, we can walk back, walk in, stand up. Your choice. It's okay to be feeling this right now. You're gonna need two plates in 15 seconds. Ah. Double squat jump. Two snatches. Go. One or two weights. Go for height. Stomp the feet into the ground. Always try the hardest option first. Don't just give in. It's not how you get your results. Halfway. If you struggle, take away the jump or lose the weight. Your choice. Ten seconds. Full sit ups are coming. With or without your weight. Feet to floor. Option. Harder with me. Challenge the car. You can bring it here. Keep the weight as close to your chest as you can. Roll through the spine. Easier option. Lose the weight. Hands on the back. Sit it up and down. Make sure that you're pulling your core in tight. 20 seconds. Bang out as many reps as you can. you can get all the way up simply making a crunch here rest 30 seconds who's keeping count last round of this four exercises Right across, drive up. Go for the height of the big. Uh, high you lift, more of your lower abs, switch sides that you're going to be using. Up and down. Box jumps are coming up. 
Work to the end. Feet wide. Drop low. Jump back. Jump up. Now this is tough because you've got pretty much every muscle in your body working here now. Keep working. 10 more, 50 to 20 more seconds. I'm gonna see you coming. Ignore me. Don't need your plates for the next move. Two and two. Quick turn. Let's go. Come on. You've got to push through that burn, that pain barrier to overload the body. Halfway, drive away from the ground. Brace the cock to catch the weight. Fifteen, set up to come in. on the bar option just use some plates first move clean and press second move plyo lunges floor is an option on the bench if you can one burpee one side step gotta love a burpee downhill skiers or a plank five seconds Bars up. Oh. Helps if I start it from the beginning, doesn't it? Go. Clean and press. Chest. Ceiling. Chest. And down. So we flick the elbows under. We pop through the heels to get underneath the bar. Brace the core, shoulders, back, full body, working here, keep moving, 
gives me a deep sweat. Twenty seconds. Come on. Fifteen left. Light lunges coming up on the floor, on the bench. Let's go for two more. One more on the bench.
moving. So you've got two choices. You can go for speed, in which case your lunge isn't going to be as low, or you can slow it down. But if you're slowing it down, I want to see deep lunges. So your bottom knee, no lower than the height of the bench. You can even alternate between the two. 30 more seconds. Drive to that front heel. Use the arms. Keep moving. Oh, stitch. Two calls to dinner time. Burpee side steps. Come in. Go. Jump or step to the side. Come on. Hold on. Oh. Keep moving. Left. 
just over. Twenty seconds. Let's smash the out.
Light on the feet, you can always work slower. You can always work easier. Or if you're on the floor, high knee rolling. Change your lead leg. Light on the feet to move quick. 20 more seconds. jumps on the bench. Still up. Feet under hips. Keep going. Now if you've not got a bench, all you need to do is start with the feet wide. Lateral jumps on the floor. If you don't like the impact, squat, step in and step wide. You've got just over 30 more seconds on the clock. So we need to really work hard as you can. Lights on the bench. Use the arms to gather some height. Keep moving, five seconds. Next one, opposite elbow to knee, or cross crawl, go. your option, twist the upper body, bring down and tap, but if you can, pull your core in tight, push your low back into the ground, twist your entire upper body, and really twist and kick out the legs nice and low.
on the clock. How are we doing? Good. Watch your squat jumps. Bench your floor. Go. Less than 
than two minutes left. Halfway, lose the impact should you need it. Twenty on the clock. Ah, yes, you can. The leg should be burning now. Cross crawls. Final. Sixty seconds work. Really start to work to the core. You can always tap the toes down if you need it. Come on. You've got to dig in. You've got to work. Halfway, just 30 seconds left. Don't give in, fight right to the end. Ah, oh. well done. So let's take a nice quick stretch. Reach as low as you can, just fold forwards 
And when you're ready, take a big deep breath in, roll up, bring the hands nice and wide, and bring the hands together. Well done everyone, that was a top effort. Remember just to adapt everything as much as you need to, but circuit is a really simple but effective way of working nice and hard. Enjoy the rest of your day.